Hey, thanks so much for coming back to J Space Reacts. Uh, continuing my Eurovision 2014 countdown, we are now at 22nd place in the grand final. That went to Azerbaijan. Um, the artist is Dilara Kazimova, and the song is Start a Fire. Hey, it's a good thing they have like a bunch of water around the stage for that. Okay, let's go. Someone said it, got roses down the square. People gathering by to breathe the morning. But no one sees the beautiful man she will learn to hate. A school girl running by and trying to beat the bed. Toys and coins and wishing ways But no one cares for dreams that don't fit into our world And we've been now you fall Dark in the sky Okay, oh, I, I know, I'm probably gonna, uh, that's okay, I'm, I have to be honest, I really didn't like that, I, I didn't, I don't know, um, if it's because, again, I can think of at least six songs from the semifinals that, to me, were a lot better than that one, um, it just seemed to drag, and a, a weird thing that I'll say is that it, she reminded me in one way of Yulia Samalova, and that was that there were times when I absolutely couldn't understand anything that she was saying. And normally I'm pretty good at being able to decipher what artists, you know, in Eurovision are saying, even if English isn't their first or even their second language. But literally, sometimes the only thing I could understand that she said was start a fire. And I don't think I would have known that if I wouldn't have known that it was the title, you know, of the song. I don't know why that is maybe it's just me but I, something about her enunciation in English I just I couldn't understand what she was saying and it got in the way I think of me being able to appreciate the song the way that it should have been appreciated because it had its sweeping moments it, it, it was definitely a beautiful ballad and you know that I love ballads but that one you know 
the fact that I couldn't understand what she was saying paired with the fact that it just didn't really seem to go anywhere um, leaves me kind of scratching my head again because I, I remember the songs from the semifinals that were so strong and I wonder how Azerbaijan got in instead of some of them. Um, so those are my thoughts. I wish that she would have sung, you know, um, her native language. I don't, I don't know what that is, but um, to me, like, I would almost had rather it have been in her native language than her trying to sing a song in English that really was difficult, you know, to understand what she was even saying. Um, she was beautiful. The performance was beautiful, uh, but I, I, it, I, I don't know. I, ugh. I just wasn't that huge of a fan of it. I'm sorry. Uh, don't hate me, Isaac Bashan. I love Dihash still. Okay. <laughs> I'll see you guys for the next reaction video. Peace.